So I've got this older Concept2 rower and I replaced the computer on it. Um, while I was on the Concept2 website, I noticed that the straps are only $2 for new ones. Um, so there were a couple accessories like that I just threw in my cart to update this. I had already updated the bungee cord in this when I first purchased it. Um, and these things are built really well, so they seem to last forever. So I updated that computer and I'm about to put the straps on. Um, I didn't see anything on the internet on how to replace the straps. So for this right strap, I actually completely took it apart to see what was on the inside there, cleaned it out. Um, but I don't think you actually need to take it apart to put the new strap on. So I'm going to attempt to put a new strap on here without really disassembling much. So there's a little screw on the bottom here that actually holds the strap in place. And I took the screw out of the right side. And so now we just take the screw out of the left here. So that screw comes out, here's the other screw, and that's the plate at the bottom that just basically holds the strap in place. And so the strap actually has a little hole in it. As you can see on the new one here, there's a little hole here. So that's where you line that up. And so we should be able to slide this out. Yep. So once that screws out, we can slide that out, take our new strap, all the way in, come back around and up the side here. We should be able to slide it up the side. The difficult thing is, is can we line up that hole on the inside, push it up through. So I think theoretically you should be able to do this, but honestly, instead of messing around, I think we'll just take the foot plate off. So there's just six screws here. Take those off. And as you can see here, that strap, it was just failing to come through here. It was just kind of hitting it on the inside. So theoretically that should be able to come through, but um, you may not be able to get that. So we'll just pull that through like that. Pull some of this dust out of here. Put the foot plate cover on. And then to string this through, you basically come up through the back side here where there's already the strap and then you just come up through the front hole. So just mimic probably how you already have your strap set up. So we have our strap set up like that. And then like I said, we want to line up that hole on the back so we can get down there and get a view. So we can see this hole here and what we want to do is pull the strap until that lines up with that screw hole right there. We want to do the same on the other side. And then we just put this cover on. And line up that screw with the hole on both sides. Make sure these are tight. So there you have it. Let's drop them down. Looks like it works. So hopefully that's helpful. Thanks.